It means that we can compare a number with the other to learn which number is greater. Yes, exactly. You can also tell which number is smaller or equal to the other number. We use three signs: greater than, less than, or equal to represent which number is greater, smaller, or equal to the other number respectively. Let's learn how to remember this with the help of my cute little brainy alligator. Hi guys, I am Brainy Alligator. I will show you an easy way to remember these signs. I always open my mouth towards the greater number. For example, eight is greater than three, so I open my mouth towards eight. Guys, can you tell me which sign resembles the open mouth of Brainy Alligator? Jack points his hand towards the number six. Yes, this one. Excellent, Jack. This sign is called the sign of greater than. Here is a question for you: Which number is smaller, four or six? Four is smaller than six, so it opens its mouth towards six. Very good. Let's see now where my little brainy alligator will next open its mouth. Now, brainy alligator's open mouth resembles this sign, which is called the sign of smaller than, as four is smaller than six. And what if two numbers are equal? Good question, Jack. Brainy alligator, please come and show us. I will not open my mouth towards any number because both the numbers are equal. Look, guys, Brainy alligator sits in between the two numbers with its mouth closed. For equal numbers, we use the sign equal to. In between the two equal numbers, it is called the sign of equal to. Remember, guys, every number is equal to itself, like two is equal to two. Now, tell me which sign will you use in between the number of fish caught by both of you? The sign of greater than, as my ten fish are greater in number than Max nine fish. Absolutely correct. Okay, I need to go now. Thank you, Brainy Man. Bye bye.